Speedbox. Break the limits. Speedbox 1.3 for Shimano, optional with B tuning and plus ETP. Necessary tools. Step 1, removing the cover. It is necessary that the e-bike motor, in which you are going to install the new version of Speedbox for Shimano, has one free e-tube port. In case you do not have a free e-tube port in the motor, please select plus e-tube port variant. Step 2. Speedbox installation. You are now watching the installation of the standard variant. You are now watching the installation of the Plus E2 port variant. The Plus E2 port variant is for motor without free E2 port. Step 3, Cover Assembly. Step 4, Tuning Control. Tuning is active immediately after the installation. To deactivate tuning, turn on the lights. To activate tuning, turn the lights off. The e-bike display shows a real speed up to approximately 23 km per hour, then the speed indicator stabilizes on this value even when riding at higher speeds. The tuning version have a Bluetooth technology and can be paired with your smartphone. After pairing with the Speedbox app, you will see real riding data on your phone's display. To deactivate tuning, turn on the lights. To activate tuning, turn the lights off. Second activation option. You can also activate or deactivate tuning directly in the Speedbox app. Speedbox app features. By clicking on the save icon, you can save the actual ride and check your performance and statistics later. You may also set up a speed warning and your own speed limit.
If you have lights installed and there's a light button on your display, you can also activate tuning by double-clicking the light button. If you enable this feature in the Speedbox app, the lights will then become independent of tuning.